Hey guys, I'm back. I think I've been posting, I think some of you have seen, I've been posting, I was um, sick with some gastro issues, um, but they have figured it out. I am on medication and today is the last day of my antibiotic. So I'm starting back today. I'm so excited. I will be doing the 21 day fix extreme. I want to try that program out and then I may go into Body Beast or do my own thing. I'm not sure. But I feel like I have, like, I, ha I feel like I have lost um, a little bit of progress uh, because what happened was I was not able to eat. And what I was eating, um, I wasn't absorbing the nutrients from that. And I feel like I have, um, I did lose some weight, but it wasn't, I didn't want to lose it and it wasn't a healthy way to lose it. So I want to get back on track and start my workouts today. And I'm going to record my workouts for you and record my nutrition, everything. Um, what I wanted to tell you was, I kind of set out my meal plan, and my hardest thing I feel like is lunch and getting like protein in for lunch, because I don't feel like I can like cook chicken breast, just really easy, and I don't like chicken breast like pre-cooked and then like put in the fridge, I don't know, I'm just weird. <laughs> but um, what I did, I've been doing, and this may work for you, so I wanted to share with you, I have been getting um, the rotisserie chicken, that are pre-cooked um, from Walmart and they actually if you go in a certain time of day they're two dollars and fifty cents for the entire chicken so I'll like take the dark meat off the legs and throw it in you know in a Tupperware and I'll take all the, the white meat off of the breast and put them in the Tupperware and that way I love the, the, the taste of rotisserie chicken so that way uh, I have a whole bowl for the week and I can just put it in a wrap or just like put it on my salad and it's been so awesome as of right now for breakfast I do my Shakeology and I put my focused energy and power greens in my Shakeology so that's like a perfect breakfast for snack I'm doing um, a baby bell cheese and uh, some almonds and some type of fruit and clementines are really easier for me apples are really easier for me uh, I might do some take some blueberries and stuff I'll do blueberries and strawberries and stuff when I'm home and I can cut them up but just to take with me those are easy so that's what I'm doing and then lunch I'm doing chicken like a chicken wrap most of the time or it might be a chicken sandwich on whole wheat bread and I do like chicken and then maybe mustard sometimes I don't put anything on it and tomato and lettuce and some bacon some turkey bacon um, or regular bacon just depends on what bacon if I need some more fat for the day. So that's my lunch. And then the next snack, I'm doing some Greek yogurt with some um, granola, but it's the low sugar granola. And for dinner, I usually just do, my dinner's like so boring, but it's easy because I can kind of figure it out that way and calculate throughout the day. I know what I'm always having for dinner. Uh, I'm always having some type of protein if it's chicken or pork um, or turkey. And I do a vegetable and like a really, a, a good carb like I'll do a brown rice or a quinoa or a sweet potato so my, my dinner is usually pretty pretty the same so I always kind of count on that for dinner unless we go out or something but that's kind of what I'm doing right now and then I'll just add I, I'm a snacker so I snack throughout the day a lot and so I kind of give myself an extra little bit of calories in case I end up snacking and if I don't I can just like have something that night to make sure I fill my calories because I don't want to be and this is this is the thing you gotta be careful of you don't want to be too low on calories because you want to feed your body and you want to be able to gain healthy lean muscle you don't want to like eat cannibalize your muscle so you do need to have an adequate amount of calories but you don't want to overeat because then you're gonna start gaining fat so just gotta find out what works for you and if you need help with figuring that out just let me know I will help you but I'm gonna do my workout now for you guys I'm gonna videotape it again it's a 21 day fix extreme and um, I'm also running some nutritional 101 parties Facebook um, group parties on online to teach you a little bit more about nutrition so you don't have to count calories with the 21 day fix system so if you're interested or want more information post down below about that but anyway um, I'm gonna do my workout now Push me down to the ground What goes around comes around You won't put the flame out You can't get to me Say what you wanna say Go take it all away But I'm here to stay No, you can't get to me And there is no barricade That I can tear away Shoot me down
reasons to doubt Try to keep me down But I'll put the flame out You can't get to me Throw your sticks and your stones Go break all of my bones You won't ache my soul You can't get to me And there is no Workout. I am having uh, on whole wheat bread. It is chicken. Sorry, the red stain from the tomato the stain on my chicken. Um, tomato and lettuce. And I have a little bit of mayonnaise, uh, um, light mayonnaise on there. And that is the lunch and All first right, workout. So, this is what's going down in the kitchen. I have organic black bean spaghetti cooking for my husband and I in this pot. I have ground turkey and this wild oats organic pasta sauce. Can't see the macros, I'm sorry, but there's only three sugars in this with a lot of them. Um, the sugars are really high and the calories are really high, so you gotta watch that. But there's, there's six carbs and three protein in that. And then over here, I am doing just the whole wheat noodles for the boys. And yeah, that's dinner. So easy. I'll have to let you know how these um, this black bean spaghetti tastes. I'm out here with the boys, and we are just, wow, my hair. Awesome. We Hi. are just playing outside. And I got so hungry after dinner, like literally so hungry. So this is what I do when I get hungry. I have decaf coffee sitting around just because, I don't know, like the warmth of the coffee like fills my belly and it's like slow and when I like feel hungry, I can just drink it. I know a lot of people say drink water when you're um, hungry and I can gulp water and I'm just, it doesn't really help me. But like the warmth of the coffee, decaf coffee or tea, I just like coffee better. Uh, so I use coffee, but anyway, it's so hot outside. I'm drinking coffee. It's so dumb, but anyway, the boys are just riding their bikes. Hey, can you show it to me? And Carter's gonna lose a tooth, and then yeah, Carter. and 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 Oliver's gonna get a haircut. Vroom, and Oliver's my best Mom, buddy too. Vroom. So we just come out here and we we ride bike, and Ow. someone dug up the <gasps> dirt. Connor, where's your other shoe, babe? Uh, Connor, look at mommy. Where's your other shoe? I don't know. Ah. Somewhere? Okay. Don't hurt your feet. So anyway, that is day today. I'm glad to be back and I'm glad to be vlogging again. And I'll be doing my workouts every day. Trying to get my meals in too if I can. That'll probably be the same thing most every day. But it's gonna oh be a while. I think it'll be the, the most same thing every day, but I'll still show you if I do something different. But see you later. Uh, uh.